of you guys basically said very similar things. Would you guys agree that women deserve less in modern day society? Yes. Yes. Misogyny. Start here. Yes or no? Yeah. You know what we'll do? We'll raise the hands. How many of you think women, modern women deserve less given the fact that it's so modern, hard to satisfy like them? Like, they, so like girls nowadays. The most, yes, like girls yes, nowadays. Modern. Raise your hands if oh. you think women deserve less. Raise it proud. Raise it, I am proud. Raise it proud. <laughs> raise it proud. <laughs> who, who? I think we all deserve <laughs> equal. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so yeah. Okay. Most. Why do you think women don't deserve less even though it's hard to satisfy women nowadays? I don't think we deserve less because I know there's women out there who give the most, you know? And then we shouldn't, like, you know, like some people are like, oh my God, I hate men. But like, you're like, why would you like say it to everyone if it's not me? You know but what I'm don't saying? women only give but, the most to a man that they think is better than themselves and is attractive in the first place? No. Really? I can promise you 100%. When have you ever, any of you, dated a McDonald's working man? Like, we fuck no, McDonald's listen. workers. You selfish <laughs> fucks have never done that in your life. You never will. That's why you burn in hell. That's you will never funny. date a man at McDonald's, no matter well, how actually, good looking actually, he is. You money grubbing. Actually, actually, actually. You think so? Actually, you think so? You, you, you really dating right now a McDonald's no, no, working no, no, man? No, no, no. Hey, hey, I have. You really I have. think so? I was not. Listen Almost to me. Her husband listen is a McDonald's worker. No, listen to me. I don't want a McDonald's worker. I do want a successful man who wants to work as hard as me. What? But at the same time, but at the same time, I'm not looking towards money. I'm looking towards personality. Holy want... cap. That's what you pause the show for? <laughs> Holy. I, heard, I hear like, this every day. No, I bet you do. I bet you do. Okay, I but you are do. you capable in your DNA? Can you date a nice Chad who works at McDonald's? <laughs> Literally, my sister hates me for it. No. Stop the cap. <laughs> no, she's like, why do you date those kind of men? It's because I like their personality. So you Weird. date McDonald's the working cap. men? It's McDonald's uh, working so real men. Quick, there's plenty of nice guys who... out there. Why don't you have a man right now? She's like, she used to be a gold digger. I, I like messed up side of her. What the fuck? <laughs> I was not a gold digger. I just yeah, date successful were. people because I want to be a successful person I mean, as I well. Like, what about the personality yeah. thing that you like? If somebody works about? as hard so, as so, me, on, that's what on. I want. So you know, do you not see what I just did? Okay. I know you guys are a little high, but I want you guys to kind of follow along here, okay? You said before, oh, like girls will date down all the time, but blah, blah, blah. the reality is most girls don't, and you don't even. Do and that. that's the truth. Okay? No, no. So what I'm saying is that since it's so hard to satisfy women, wouldn't wouldn't it be fair to say that women deserve less a lot of the times because they don't appreciate anything? No. You don't think so? Most. Hold on. I mean, some, yeah, but that's the same with men. It goes vice versa. You can't just put people in a group. Well, you just admitted earlier that it's harder to please men. Sorry, it's harder to please women than it is to please men. And simple, that's right? true. Yeah, because so of why social would men media. deserve less? Mm. I mean, I guess you do have a point. Listen, I'm here to learn. Like you can laugh. That's fine. It's all. It's all here for fun. No, I'm and just games. saying because it's, it's just. It's just that's fine. Like like females, a lot of the times. No offense, <laughs> ladies. You guys don't have logic. Like you guys just say what sounds good, but a lot of times you're. If I challenge you, know points, what's it makes crazy? No I believe you because you know it's crazy. <laughs> you're. No, hold on. Okay, but listen. You know, sometimes when you're thinking mad or sad, you're like logical thinking. It goes away. It goes away. Right, right. Women are right now. It actually goes away, and that's the truth. When does it come back? (laughs) (laughs) And that's also the truth. Here's the truth. Why it's so hard to please women. Because we're more emotional. It's very hard to please a confused retard. Another thing. Women do not want to be treated like queens. They want to be treated like princesses. They want their ass wiped by a father figure. (laughs) Or they leave you. They, if you give them the queen treatment, they will leave you. If you give them the princess thing, oh, wait, my ass, please. What, what he means by that is you women. Can... Women need a leader. <laughs> they need a coach. They need someone that's better than them in every regard. Women don't seek their equal. I know your sister made fun of you for dating rich guys, but a part of the reason why you wanted guys that were rich is because they were better than you. Women yeah. don't seek their equal. They weren't better so than me. We need they were actually the reason we broke up is because I was better than them, and they were jealous. That proves my point even more. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah. I know, right? <laughs> so she's you're saying, you're, stupid. Stupid. you're saying we need a dad. Yeah. No, what yeah, I'm saying whatever. is that. No, I'm saying you're aroused <laughs> and attracted by a dad. That's why you bitches love tattoos because it shows experience, and we hate tattoos because it shows lack of purity. Like you went into the wilderness, got fucked by a tattoo artist. <laughs> you guys like an older looking dude. We like a younger looking what is this woman. On your when we head? see Hillary Clinton, you nothing happens to our genitals. No, he, he said, said tattoos he said, are attracted yeah, by yeah, men. Not, you you guys think that. George Clooney's hot? We would have never, we wouldn't, not even with a flagpole would we touch Hillary Clinton. <laughs> you know what I mean? You guys like older, you're right? You guys are reverse pedophiles. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. Um, no, but yeah, so like I mean, that proves my point even more. Women don't seek their equal, they want it better, which is why, no offense, True. I don't mean to pick on you, but 
I could tell from the way that you speak about your man and everything else like that. You kind of tolerate him. He's what I would call a placeholder boyfriend. But the reality is you're not really fully satisfied by him because a masculine part of a man's duty is taking care of his woman, being a protector, a provider, all these things. And since you're in a provider role, now you've taken the masculine role. And it's fine. You don't have to admit anything. But I can tell just from your mannerisms, you don't really truly love, admire, and respect your man to the highest degree. You're kind of with him. How a woman sees her boyfriend, like when she's having brunch with her friends, the way they talk about them is like the, it's their Pokemon. Like, <laughs> the bitch who got me the Charizard, right? She's very happy. Even if I'm like verbally abusive and shit, she's happy. She's like, I got a Charizard. I feel good and safe. And the, the girls who have simps and Charmanders, they're coping. They're like, I actually like a smaller flame. You know what I mean? <laughs> Let me say this. This is gonna sound fucked up, but I'm gonna I keep like it a thousand all the way with y'all ladies. And I wanna I wanna get your guys late takes on this, like, but this I is what know. I think. If a girl when women walk into a room with each other, right? The girl that is the biggest flex is the girl that has the most successful man yes. in the highest levels of a relationship. If she's married to a fucking millionaire or a guy with status or whatever, she can be a complete bum with no life skills. She will be able to flex on the other girls there that might be a doctor. When a girl walks into a room and she's a doctor, but she's single. And she's like 35. The girls are like, mm. she has money and she's successful. Who gives a fuck? I have a high status man. The biggest flex for a woman is the man that she's with and the last name she's able to acquire. Mm. Men, biggest flex for us is our status and our income. Women, men and women flex differently. So what do you guys think? Do you guys agree with that sentiment or you disagree? Start I, I agree. Yeah. You agree? I agree. Yeah. Agree? Yeah. You disagree? Okay, that's fine. I 100% agree. You agree? Agree. Agree. <laughs> agree. Okay. Agree. 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 Okay, so why do you disagree? I'm interested. I want to hear her perspective. Why do you disagree with that? So, what do we... Hold on. I Here know. we go. Wait, you know what's a girl something you don't even know? Hold on. No, I know that. What is the biggest flex then? Hold on, Mom. Hold on, Mom. In your case, then, what's the biggest flex? My biggest flex yeah. for myself? Yeah. Oh. My TikTok, I guess. Whoa. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's stupid to okay. y'all, I know, but All what's right. your biggest flex? Right? What, yeah, what do you so like, have a, Well, so, he, he just said it. So what do you yeah. like status and money, but I mean yeah. so like what do you post? I mean, on like my money <laughs> then, you know, TikTok gets my money, right? No, so, I, I understand that, but what I said was the biggest flex for a woman is walking into a room and being in a no, serious yeah, and I relationship completely disagree with, with a man who's yeah. a winner. I mean, I guess I do agree with that because I am trying to build his status up. You know, you know what I noticed? Mm -mm. My, well, here's the thing. If it was the other way around, look, 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 let's say he had the big TikTok. He was the one providing for you. Mm -hmm. He would still respect you as a chick. It wouldn't be the same. Like men don't give a fuck about a woman's status, but a woman does care about a man's status, which is why you're trying to elevate your guys. You know what I noticed also, Myron? Yeah, I've sure. never, ever in my life I mean, respected a woman who's not... If a, if a woman's not married... I cannot see her as human and respect her. But, <laughs> no, I'm serious. If I see like a nice Muslim marriage or, or a Christian Where marriage, I have immense respect for a woman for the first time in my life. But if she's single, has a boyfriend or like fiance or, you know, can't do it. Where did yeah. you find this guy? I'm not <laughs> on, on, on 4chan. Yeah. 4chan. No, I mean, but the reality is, is that like, you know, women chase a career and make money, whatever. Sorry. But the reality is the biggest flex is do you have a successful man by your side that takes you seriously? I think that's the biggest like, flex. Think of women. Cristiano Ronaldo's bitch when she goes to brunch. That bitch is glowing, yeah. and the fucking feminists around her, they're kind of depressed, sad, and attempting suicide. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. True, man. True. Yeah. Um, so, can I say something? Absolutely. If you can remember what was spoken about yeah. a second prior. <laughs> they're going to make me forget. So hold on. Okay, go ahead. Um, so like to saying like all that is like even if he doesn't have a high status as me, he still makes me feel good when I go in public. He praises me. He makes me feel like I don't say. It like, doesn't matter if it's deep down in your I psyche. Happy, it doesn't matter deep down I in your psyche. Great. According to Sigmund Freud, you think this guy is gonna abandon your children because he's a really? simp bitch, and you abandon him and get fucked by a big black guy. <laughs> if he if he's comforting <laughs> you temporarily, it doesn't ensure your offspring's okay. safety. Wait, 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 let's let him finish your point because I think she was going to go somewhere else with it. What, where, go ahead. You said you need to be validated by your guy. Explain that No, again. what I was saying is um, it doesn't matter his status compared to my status. Like if if I, I'm i going out and my status is higher than his, he, yeah. he's praising me as I go out. What if he's he, McDonald's? Like, what if he works at McDonald's? So that's the same. Or if you go the same as that, if he works at McDonald's and say I worked at McDonald's, like I don't, I'm not going to date him if he works at McDonald's. <laughs> So status does matter, clearly. That. So status does matter. Status is everything at this point. I'm not going to let stop, stop the show. Stop the show. Stop the show. Stop the show. You know what I mean? I don't think you understand the concept I'm here. not going to let someone date me. Okay, look, look, look. I need you to, to 
get it together and listen for two You're seconds. You're not understanding me. No, I completely understand, which is why I'm about to say this to you. The, the difference is I'm listening, understanding, then telling you. You said that you would have date a guy at McDonald's. Here's the difference. If he had the TikTok followers, he had the money, and you worked at McDonald's, he would date you. That's my point. It wouldn't be the other way around. Like, you're the selfish gender. Get there faster. You guys are the selfish gender. We something? see a poor woman covered in dust. And but we go, bitch, I'll save you. You guys see a poor homeless guy covered in dust. You walk by us. He's overdosing on fentanyl. You disgusting <laughs> animal. But I thought, like, the whole thing was, it's like you see a nice, successful nurse compared to a woman with a nice, successful man. It's like that nice, successful nurse woman has a boyfriend praising her. She's glowing, too, right? Well, I, I think the, the other... thing you're missing here is that men don't care about a woman's status. Yeah, but some of them do. Nope. most don't. Nope. Well, well, don't. Bums care the ones about that your do status. are the ones no. that you don't really they're want because they're gonna try to finesse you. No. They'll try to finesse you, use you, Learning. manage you. She's like, getting... yeah. I'm gonna you be honest. Know. Like, can Flashbacks. I? Can I just ask her? Uh, <laughs> well, I'm more or less gonna just say this. I was in a relationship for five years that went nowhere. I was with my childhood sweetheart. And I was the breadwinner. You know where it led me? You know why I broke up the relationship? Because I asked him, what are your true dreams? What do you aspire to be? What are we going to do after this? You know what he told me? I don't know. So since when he said, I don't know, what did I do? I broke it off because I was not going to spend another five years of my life, mm -hmm. end up having a child or anything like that when it's not going anywhere. Yeah, that's why if I, I have to sit here and put my right. money and resource into you. I'm going to get tired of your shit. Mm -hmm. I bet you right now mm -hmm. you're probably tired of his shit because he's not pulling up what you're having right now deep down inside. Like, think about it. He told her, I don't know, and it <laughs> spiked so her anxiety forever. That's why I teach men to lie. Get a few more years of the pussy. <laughs> but again, status is everything. Mm -hmm. You women can actually fuck an ugly dude on a yacht whose scrotum hangs to the ocean, you disgusting animals. <laughs> would this guy fuck Hillary Clinton on a yacht just because she got money? Myron would say, oh, no. fuck okay, no. Okay, Leave I me get... with my fucking fentanyl under a bridge. <laughs> I get what like, you're saying. Yeah, man. like, yeah, like, status is very important, man. And, like, um, yeah, like, no. like she said, here's the difference. If my girl said, I don't know, as a leader, it's my job to teach her what to know. See the difference? As a woman, if your guy says, I don't know, you're like, what the fuck? Like, I'm out. This don't sit loser, there and try to build right? a man. But uh, yeah, like a woman can't build it. a man. However, a man can Could absolutely build a, build a woman because I am supposed to be the leader, the dominant. I'm supposed to guide you in life. Oh, I don't know. Let me educate you. X, Y, Z, boom, boom, boom. And teach the woman, make her a better girl. But on the other side, women are not going to sit there and build you up as a man. And if they do, they're going to get frustrated and tired of you. Question. Yeah. Did that make sense to you? Yeah, it did. So now knowing this. New, uh, new information. Well, when you put like it in that way, like the Hillary Clinton versus a dude, and what we, what girls and guys get with, <laughs> mm -hmm. you're probably right, and it is true. Is Hillary Clinton from Arkansas, by the way? Bill Clinton is. Yeah, Bill Clinton is. Yeah, he's from here. So, so mm -hmm. I'm just curious. Going forward, what are you gonna do? Um, oh, shit, do well, you know? I'm, like as much as people. She's gonna wait till he's about well, to he bust, definitely... and he's gonna be like, I don't know. That's <laughs> <laughs> right inside. <laughs> I would say this. So anytime when a woman does get in a relationship with a man, you do have to think about how it would be in the future. Let's mm -hmm. say hypothetical, if you have a baby with him, is there resources that you could take time off of what you do in order to take care of a child? I bet you the answer is no. Yes. No, no. I believe he does. He's really good at communicating. He's really good at no, 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 communicating. No. Communicating is not going to take care of a child, babe. Yeah, no. No. Taking care of a child's yeah, stability we is a whole kitty different cats thing. At home that we take no, 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 mommy. <laughs> a kitty cat and a baby are completely two different things. But it's a start. You know? Men watching, if if the, your girl's not trying to trap you with a baby, that bitch going to cheat on you. All right. The only thing that they do is like, for kids yeah. it's all for kids so if she's dating you four years and she doesn't bring it up and shit you guys are done that's why all my bitches try to trap me with a kid and these dumb bitches don't realize you can't get pregnant when i'm busting your throat i tricked her <laughs> but yo, check it out she's either being the mom of your kids or getting fucked by a big black, black. Cock. Cock. Tyrone. Oh, okay. 